Hello. My name is Rusty. I'm excited to be here from our time with God. It's great to have time with him and learn from him. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, ah, the world is getting worse and worse, but we don't want to think about that. We push that aside and look to you. We want to learn from you. Thank you again for your love for us. We love you in Jesus' name. Amen. So what was the first bird that Noah let out of the ark? Do you know? It could be one of two things, a dove or a raven. Do you know which one was first? A raven. That one's right. I hope you're learning something and you're eager about things in the Bible. Okay, so what's next? Wait quietly. It's hard. It's hard for me to wait and be patient and wait for God's time. In Psalm chapter 62, verse 5, it says, My soul, wait thou only upon God, for my expectation is from him. Patience is challenging. Do you notice the world? It has a tendency to want things now. But as Christians, as believers, we need to wait on God's timing. He'll let you know when something's supposed to happen at the perfect time. Our minds are limited, so we need to be patient and wait for his timing. And then when the thing happens, we need to thank him for everything. Make sure that you're not dwelling on the past because the past is over and the future hasn't happened. We can't fix the past, but we have now. And we can focus on going forward and wait for God's timing on things. God knows what's going to ha happen. So we need to wait for those things, for his timing. And then you'll have blessings from God. Amen? I know it's challenging. But that's a good lesson that God teaches us. Okay, let's pray. Heavenly Father, Thank you, Lord, that you know that waiting on you, Lord, it's hard. But God, you always have perfect timing. We're weak. We like things now. But Lord, help us to be patient. Teach us to wait for your timing for things to happen. Thank you for everything you taught us today. We love you. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, I'm excited. Are you excited for Bible trivia? So what's our question today? Will it be hard or easy? Let's see. I hope you're excited and know the answer. <laughs> what was the name of Abraham's nephew? Hmm. Type in if you know the answer. Go ahead. And I hope you enjoy your day. Remember, God will always be with you, my precious brothers and sisters in Christ. Bye.